Welcome clients and guests to my channel. I'm Jason Cerro and I'm a licensed professional counselor. My videos are designed to educate and empower you to make informed decisions about your mental health. The Big Five personality traits are the best and most commonly used scientific model in personality psychology. It's easily remembered by the acronym OCEAN, O-C-E-A-N. Openness to experience, conscientiousness, extroversion, agreeableness, and neuroticism. The five traits can be broken down even further for a total of 10 categories. Openness and in intellect, industriousness and in orderliness, enthusiasm and assertiveness, compassion and politeness, and withdrawal and volatility. People high in openness to experience are curious and interested in novelty and change. They are interested in learning and engaging in abstract thinking and prefer to discuss philosophical issues such as the meaning of belief systems and ideologies. There seems to also be a preference for fiction which allows us to experience simulated worlds and could actually help us improve our interpersonal effectiveness. Concerts, movies, plays, and art shows are attended, and there is a curiosity and interest in abstract ideas and complex problems. People high in openness to experience have a wide range of interests, are often artistic, have an expanded vocabulary, can easily express their new ideas, and are entrepreneurial in spirit. They welcome intellectual problems and challenges. Openness to experience is the best predictor of political allegiance with liberals being more likely than conservatives to be higher in this trait. Intellect is a sub-trait of openness to experience and is distinct from IQ in that it measures interest in abstract ideas and creativity. And IQ measures verbal ability, processing speed, working memory, and problem-solving abilities. Intellect and intelligence are measured through psychometrics. IQ has the most validity in its measurements within the field of social sciences. People lower in intellect are less likely to be interested in abstract ideas or philosophical concepts. They are much less interested in issue-oriented discussions and shy away from idea-centered books. Vocabulary use tends to be less and they tend to stick to what works as opposed to trying something new. New experiences and situations are avoided altogether. Individuals lower in openness, the second subtrait, tend to gravitate towards stable, straightforward, and traditional jobs, where the parameters of the responsibilities are defined and consistent. Individuals high in openness, which remember is different from openness to experience, 
find various ways to be creative, are interested in the beauty of things, like architecture, enjoy music, and get immersed in a great book, a movie, or even their own thoughts. People low in openness do not find beauty important and usually don't notice it, do not require creative outlets, couldn't care less about arts and crafts, are insensitive to color and architectural form, are much less imaginative, stay within their preferred genre of music, are much less musical and artistic, and rarely enjoy books, movies, or their own thoughts.